Hello! I'm Sean. I've been a fan of the Gabriel Knight series for about 15 years or so. I discovered it late, probably 15 years after it came out. Uh, but the impact of its story and its music was not dulled one bit. It quickly became one of my favorite adventure game series of all time, and even though I actually haven't really replayed them, um, I've listened to the soundtrack a good couple of dozen times over the years. So just perfect <laughs> for just encapsulating the feel and the themes of those games. And I can listen to the music and just feel totally transported back into my memories of playing those. If I had to pick a favorite track, I think just due to its versatility and emotional impact, I'm gonna go with the Gabriel Knight main theme. The only way I can describe that song is that it is absolutely badass. Like, it's got that perfect blend of just like the driving, rocking groove. There's all this like gothic horror mixed in. It's got this great big sweeping emotional dramatic stuff. It all just sums up what those games are, which is just being this action-packed, cerebral, supernatural, mystery, drama, adventure. And one thing I really like about it is that it can be transposed into new forms. Like we have the St. George's book theme of the game, which is the same melody, more or less, of the GK theme, but now it's just this cozy, comfortable, like very homey and warm feeling, like plucky string variant, um, that I could just listen to that for ages too. I mean, Robert's score, like, whenever he does action, he does it really, really well. But it is like those more outside of the action, slower paced, you know, you know, exploring different emotions and corners of the, uh, the rich tapestry of what's going on. That's what keeps bringing me back to those soundtracks. Um, I've loved what Robert's done post GK, and I really like uh, sequel, his album that came out last year. Uh, and it's very easy to let the mind fill in the blanks of like, oh man, the game that would exist that this music is for is just, it's, why, is, why isn't it made? <laughs> we all know why. Uh, license holders. Anyway, um, my favorite track of that is probably Bottom Dwellers um, because it kind of, it kind of hits that same vibe in a strange, not quite the same way as the St. George's Books theme. Like, it's more downtrodden, um, it's a little darker, um, but it feels like if there were a GK4, that seems like it would be the song that would be like your home base kind of uh, vibe, which is the place that Gabriel is at the end of the third game, lost a lot. Um, I have no idea if that was Robert's intention when he made the Bottom Dweller song, but it's where my mind goes, uh, and I like it. So thanks, Robert. Uh, uh, the whole album is great, and you should back Son of Sequel.